look at you. How are you, my friends? Scott Hine with the with the information card right yeah. here. Good to have you back, some Good man. to see you, my man. Did you see Mark Charles cheat on that question? That's all he does. Yeah. Nonsense. That's Santa what I knows. Heard. Santa there. knows. Santa knows. He had a helper tonight too. Yep. Stay safe. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. She's over there trying to say cookie. He's like a, a what? Yeah. A who now? Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Pitiful. All right, so what we're talking about that's not pitiful is GP66. This is a supersized green miracle cleaner and degreaser. We have just sprayed spray paint on tile. We're using permanent marker on ceramics, and we're going to let all that dry. Mm -hmm. And then we're going to come back and show you how GP66 almost erases it away. Let me also tell you that this is a phenomenal cleaner on just about every surface in your home. You get not one, but two of these. Yes, sir. And these will ship right to your door for uh, two payments of $12.49. First, let's talk about GP66. Who makes this? What is it? Great family company out of Baltimore, Maryland. Three generations. They make one thing and they make it great. GP66, it's what you reach for when you reach for everything else. It is a phenomenal degreaser. And now's the time when we're doing the most clean cooking, so we need to be doing the most cleaning. And this is the kind of stuff we're talking about. This is what you would call like basically the grease trap from the hood of your stove or from your microwave. So what happens is not only the grease build up in there, but the odors build up as well. So you see first and foremost how it's breaking down that grease, and these things are about eight or nine dollars a piece. So you don't want to have to keep replacing them, but watch what happens with the GP66 when I just drop it down into some water. Look how that grease melts right off of that grease trap, spinning around just a little bit here, and then we bring it back out. It's like it's new again, and so instead of you know spending money to replace it, you, those grease is gone, the odors are gone, thanks to GP66. Ooh, I'll tell you, I'm going to see mom tomorrow. I fly down to North Carolina tomorrow, mm -hmm. but it was back in August when I was visiting her. My brother and I were visiting. We had just finished up breakfast, and mom was in the kitchen cleaning the stove after breakfast. She came into the into the dining room to tell, something, um, to tell us something, and I noticed she had a cleaner in her hand, and she had <laughs> turned around, and I said, Mom, what is that? And she said, oh, honey, this is GP66. I ordered it from your show. And I said, first of all, you should have called me. I would have sent it to you. And she said, secondly, I didn't want to bother you. And third, I said, well, do you like it? She said, honey, it's the best cleaner I've ever used. Uh, that's, and I appreciate that so much. She uses it on much. her glass stove top, and she says it takes the burn rings off of her stove Oh, top. that's great. And I, I really do appreciate that. It means a lot because, again, this is a family-owned company out of Baltimore, Maryland. They do one thing, and they do it really well. So here's spray paint that has now dried. Take that GP66, breaks it all the way down, emulsifies it, knocks it down to the molecular level and it is gone so even if you don't have to be in the kitchen say you're driving down the road and they're painting the road I just saw it the other day near my house this is the stuff that gets up in your wheel well when you have GP 66 it knocks it out completely now you're not getting one bottle of this you're getting two we just cut through spray paint on tile now watch it emulsify permanent marker that's right I said permanent marker Look at this. It's already breaking down just when Scotty sprays it. Yeah. When he rubs it with a cloth, it's like a pencil eraser. Yeah, the only reason I need the cloth is to clean up the solution. <laughs> that marker is gone, gone for good. So permanent marker really isn't so permanent anymore, is it? Yeah, right? <laughs> so it's all about taking advantage of this on so many surfaces in your home. Now, when you cook in your kitchen and there is grease in what you're cooking, that grease becomes airborne. Now, where does the grease land? Okay, well, it lands on your stovetop, sure. Mm -hmm. Lands on your countertop, that's to be expected. Sure. You know what also lands on your cabinet doors? That's exactly right. And this is what sold me on GP66 the very first time I used it several years ago. We moved into a house, it's an older house built in the 50s, and so we come in and we look at the cabinets, they've got that film on them. You know, they look just slimy, you know, they just don't look right. So when you put the GP66 on, as you do this, you think to yourself, okay, Scott, I guess that looks a little bit better. You know, I guess that, you know, we're maybe getting some until you do this. Oh. That's the grease, the grime that's hidden in it. That's what's full of the odors. That's what makes the cabinets look bad, but it makes them smell bad too. It traps them. When you're the GP66, it is an industrial strength degreaser. It's used in over 900 million square feet of offices, auto body shops, arenas, that kind of thing every single night. This is why, because it's knocking the grease out and knocking it out for good. How many gone now, Sean? 700 sets are gone. You know, you think about your cookware, and occasionally something gets away from us on the stove, phone rings, great show on TV, something on Facebook you can't tear yourself away from, right? And then something burns on the stovetop, sometimes on the outside of the pan. Scotty's able to spray this with GP66, and just from spraying it, it's going to uh, it's going to melt through all of that yuck and uh, 
mess on the bottom of the pan. Yeah, what we did here, David, is we took browning gravy and we burnt it on with a blowtorch. Way worse than anything that would be in your own home. But what I want you to see is I only reason I'm using this much is just to illustrate how strong it is. So I don't actually need to use the rag except just once again to clean up the actual brown and gravy itself. So you're coming back through, you're restoring the shine, restoring the luster. Now obviously if you have, you know, 15 year old pots and pans, it's not going to do the same job. But for the daily maintenance of your temptations, your cook's essentials, oh, yeah. a lot of things, your microwave, for example, a lot of grease builds up in there. This is the way to go, brings it back to life. Over a thousand sets are gone now. You get two big bottles of this. And I'll tell you, QVC.com and QVC mobile app, Best way to get through right now. We're very, very busy. Over a thousand sets are gone. So let's get over here and talk about this. Yeah, so our good friend Mark Charles Masilli has a wonderful pair of shears. You use these shears, for example, to do tree trimming this yep. time of year, whatever it might be. Well, the problem is the pine is, it's a little bit dirty, but it's got sap on it. And then you start trimming, you know, cutting these up. Well, all of a sudden, that sap starts getting on your hands, gets on your fingers, and it's sticky and it's disgusting. Well, right. how about what you do is you take the GP66, <coughs> you spray it there, it breaks that down. Down, you rub it there and then you spray it on his shears to clean them up. We'll take the towel, we'll wipe them off. That sap is broken down, your hands are all cleaned up, and you're ready to go. That sticky mess is now on the rag, not on the shears. Or, or your, your hands. hands. Yep. Exactly right. And then if you think about hardwood floors as well, or tile, take a look at this video. Yeah, it, this is shot in a house, and this was not something where we put dirt down ahead of time. This is in a real home, we went to a real oven, real tiles, and cleaned it up. It's one of the best tile cleaners you will ever see. So already here, David, we have cleaned up a wood cabinet, a grease trap, ceramic tile, a stainless steel pot. We've done uh, a tool with pine sap on it, and we're gonna do a hardwood floor. This is outside on concrete, that green yucky stuff that builds up. Use a GP66 and like a bug sprayer, take, a, take a, uh, a scrub brush with a hose. You will be amazed at how much better the outside of your home looks. I'll tell you also, brake dust can be a real problem. It doesn't have to be, not with GP66. Want to clean your grill? You're good to go there as well. Don't miss out on this opportunity. We are approaching 2,000 gone now. Everyone's loving the easy pay. Two easy payments on your credit card tonight at 1249. How about a white leather chair? So this is the kind of chair you might find in a studio or a salon somewhere. Well, what happens is makeup, hairspray builds up on it. So, you know, those are all oil-based stains, even, you know, sweat, things like that. So you take a little bit of the GP66, you put it on a, on, a, on a rag or a towel, and then look at this. I'll come here just on one side of this. This is white leather. So now this is about the sixth or seventh surface that I've shown you I've used to clean up. Check this out, that's that oil and grease based stain, brings that white leather back to life. And again, we clean this ahead of time. Look at the difference of what was there before, what's gone now. You have refreshed your pots, your pans, your stove, your cabinets, your leather chairs. GP66 can be used throughout the home. Now, how many are gone? 2,500 are gone now and 500 people on the phone lines. Now, uh, 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 Easy Pay is something that makes this even more attractive because now you're getting that great cleaner and you're getting Easy Pay. Look at it cut right through the grime on this hardwood floor. Now we took the sealed hardwood floor and we covered it with shoe polish and grease. Way worse than anything to be in your own home. But we did that to prove the point that this will cut right through that grease, restore the hardwood, but you get the scuff marks from shoes, but you're not going to take the finish off the wood. Exactly. And we do it all for you tonight at a great price and easy pay. What you don't want to do is wait on this because Scott is spraying this carpeting. You might be thinking, well, GP66 must be white. That's why it looks white on that carpet. Yeah, it's that's actually, sun, right? yeah, no. that's actually the yeah. color of the carpet coming through because the dirt is being emulsified. We soaked this carpet with a combination of brown and gravy, soy sauce, coffee, and mud. Again, way worse than anything you find in your own home, but this is eliminating it right at the source. So again, I can come in here with a towel, blot this, and that doesn't change color. That is the color of the carpet. GP66 makes an incredible pre-treater. Same thing here, like I have an older coffee mug. So this coffee stain builds up, could be you know a little bit of hard Just water. Just so you know that's a percolator. That's why I'm not in your show that much, I'll be mm. honest with mm. you. I don't know mm. these things. Got I'm the um, later. Yeah, but at least I don't lie like Mark Charles Masilli and Mark um, Charles Stacey is Stauffer. a cheater. Yeah, I don't cheat, I don't lie. Uh, your mom actually likes my products. Yeah, so, you know, oh, wow. Uh, yeah. Slow down there. It's okay. too close yeah. to Christmas to make, it to make enemies. Christmas, but I, Santa Claus. I don't know. All right, fine. All but right. anyways, that being said, you <laughs> want to bring back your percolator to life? 
This is the way to do it. GP66, not just for your kitchen, but works great in the kitchen throughout your entire home. Get rid of the One grease. One little clarification, and he just goes down the wrong path, doesn't he? Because Christmas is so close, and That's Santa funny. is watching. And on that note, I really hope you have a very Merry Christmas, you <laughs> and your family. You. Thanks for having Thank me back. You. It's a pleasure. It's always it really good is. to have you back. How many of these are gone now, Sean? 3,500 are gone, and we got hundreds of folks on the phone lines. Be safe. All the best to your family, sir. Thanks, pal. Be well. Merry man. Christmas. See ya. Good to see you. Oh, you guys, we have pot stickers coming up.